Hi everyone, I'm Steven, my pronouns are he, him, and I am one month post top surgery. In order to celebrate and commemorate the experience and getting over the largest, kind of most complicated part of uh, recovery, I thought that I would make a video compilation of little clips and snippets that I took over the last month. Uh, so I hope that you enjoy. top surgery. Um, it is currently 11 in the morning. I have to be at the hospital for 1230. Um, I'm a little sleepy this morning because I haven't been sleeping all that great. I just got all those jitters like pre-surgery jitters. I'm just like excited and nervous and also hungry all at the same time. Um, so I just tried to sleep the day away yesterday so that today would come sooner um, and then I couldn't sleep all majority of the night. So anyways, um, super excited um i was worried and nervous for like weeks and months kind of leading up to this but now that the day is finally here i feel like more excited than a kid on christmas morning um so all my nerves are gone uh all my fear all my doubts everything is gone because i'm just so excited and so 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 ready to get this um i showered this morning because I won't be able to shower for a week and I absolutely hate stinking. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, now I'm just kind of waiting around. Um, I did my stretches this morning. I did all my laundry, um, moved everything to like lower shelves, I, like got all my supplies, got my pillows. So I think I'm ready. Like I think, I don't think there's anything else that I can really do to prepare. Um, yeah yeah i'm uh just super 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 ready and i'll keep everyone posted on how things are going bye bobo bye moose bye baby about an hour ago and I'm just sitting in my room now I got my markings and had a little bit of a chat with the surgeon and now I'm just waiting for my turn to go in um, so I think I'll probably be in in the next hour or so um, and again like just all my Fear and anxiety has just gone through the window and I'm just so excited now. I did it. I did it. Still looks like I have tatas, but I'm pretty sure it's just gauze. Um, pain has been pretty minimal. Um, the worst part, I think, is the back pain and the shoulder pain, just from like not really sleeping all that great. Um, but last night, I think I found a little bit more of a comfortable position than the first night. Um, I've got a little bit of itchiness going on right here, mostly because of the bandages and that extra gauze that's packed in here, because um, of some of the bleeding that I had. Bloating is pretty minimal. I was actually expecting a lot worse. It's, it's not too bad. Like I feel like a, like a legitimate human. Um, and my arm movement, pretty mild. Like I can't really go too high. Um, I was advised not to. Overall, day two is going really well and I feel really, really good. So I'm excited to see the results. Um, I have my appointment at 3.25 with the surgeon tomorrow. It's only three days post-op. Uh, so I will keep everyone posted. And yeah, hopefully I'm happy with what I see. doctors yesterday to see everything 
Um, everything looks good, it's healing well. I can kind of move my arms a little bit, um, just like that. Minimal swelling, minimal bruising, a little bit of blood. I have to wear a compression for a month, um, but tomorrow's my first shower, so I get to take it off and let the water run on my chest a little bit. I just took my incision tape off. Um, I am one month post-op on Thursday, so technically I'm two days early, but that's okay. Um, and everything's looking so good. Look, he did such a great job. I'm so excited. I thought I would be a little bit more scared um, because of all the crusty blood that was on there on the on the incision tape, uh, but it actually came off, and the stars are pretty nice and thin so far um, which is wonderful there are a couple spots that are, are a little weird so like I've got here sorry it's kind of gross but I've um, got a little hole here so um, this is called suture spitting and it's when suture underneath the skin gets essentially expelled um, because it's a foreign body instead of dissolving properly. So that's kind of gnarly right there. I've got a couple of them. Um, I've also got a little bit of like acne and stuff and like some obviously a little bit of rough kind of tender skin around the incisions. But all in all, like this is so awesome. Um, and my nipples are getting weird coloration. So you can kind of tell here, um, pigments coming back. It used to be just all pink, but now it's like a semicircle of brown, which is kind of funky. Um, healing is weird. Healing is weird. But yeah, look at that. It's so cool. Anyways. That's my update. I just wanted to share. Um, yeah, that's it.